You want to find out if you're actually in love? Okay. <laughs> Today you can. Today's the day you could find out absolutely if you're in love or not. It's All like right. a test or something. It's kind of like a test. All you got to do is ask yourself, what are you expecting for Valentine's Day? What are you expecting? What are you expecting for Valentine's Day? Al, you have a girlfriend. What are you expecting? Honestly, just time. But y'all don't have it because she's working. Well, it, so you're not expecting it. It won't it, right? be today, but <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, she's working. So, but but you know, but, time but, time spent together. That's 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 mm-hmm. all I'm expecting. Al, I would say you are in love. Bam! I passed. Here's the thing: if you answer, I'm not expecting any specific gift, which is kind of what you answered, Al. Okay. Then you're in love. It's those people that are that are. You know, if you're saying I want flowers or a really expensive dinner or I hope for the diamond, then you're not really in that. Oh, that's BS. That, that hey. is BS. I don't know where you got that. Oh, from, just because a woman wants flowers does not mean she's not in love. From a little that university. So crappy. From a little university called <laughs> Yale University. Well, Yale yeah. is uh-huh. stupid. Yeah, I don't Yale know. is I stupid. Mean, that is stupid. You don't tell me that if a woman expects flowers on Valentine's Day, she's not in love. That's B. I'm almost about to cuss. <laughs> Keep going, JC. Make Kelly cuss. But I'm just saying, if, if you say, I'm not expecting any specific gift, which actually Kenzie said the same thing. Yeah. I'm not really I'm expecting really, any I'm really specific. I, I, know she, oh, please. I know she's in love you with me You better give now. her flowers, because every woman expects flowers. Okay. But that's not what she's answering. Well, that doesn't mean she's not in love. <laughs> Yale. Yale. It doesn't Kelly. matter. Yale. Yale You're Kelly. wrong. Ivy League. Ivy. Ivy League. Yeah. That's stupid. <laughs> It's not that stupid. How do, how do you and then tell it somebody sense. if you expect something, that means you're not in love? That's what we there have smart no, people. Smart people no do it didn't say. That. It didn't say if you're expecting something, you're not in love. It just said if you're, if expecting, you're not expecting. If you're expecting flowers, you're not in love. Here's, here's, said, here's what they're Al. saying. What, Scientifically like, proven that. I no science to that. When, when you're really in love. <laughs> science. When you're really in love, it switches off the part of the brain that's actively and selfishly seeking rewards. They ain't got no switch and no brain, and they're stupid. <laughs> so it's so ridiculous. Instead, your brain is getting a rush just from selflessly caring so much about See, another person. I'm selfless, Al, selflessly. I'm no, or maybe you get, get a so, rush. Yeah. You tell me a woman doesn't get a little rush when she sees a little box about she, to open. I'm sure she does. There's a rush there, I'm and sure that doesn't she does. mean she's not in love. But she's not ex- if she's not expecting oh, it. That might crap. mean, and if you don't get anything because you're not expecting anything, that means you're probably in love with someone that doesn't care about you. And then, oh, no. You no. can love someone can... and expect to get something. I'm sorry. Well, I expect to get something.